We're going to turn now to that wild scene on the streets of Los Angeles overnight. An RV leading police on a high speed chase, slamming them to cars and trees. The driver's dog even making a desperate escape. ABC's Adrian Banker is in Los Angeles with more. Good morning, Adrian. Good morning to you too, Michael. Yes, the scene from this chase, unreal. There were six cars hit, two people were injured besides the driver. The dogs are okay in this harrowing ride that lasted half an hour. Oh no! This bizarre high-speed pursuit involves a stolen 20-foot RV, a driver on the run, and two dogs. This is incredible. The driver who's out of control with two large dogs on her lap. The woman behind the wheel weaves in and out of traffic at speeds of up to 70 miles per hour through residential neighborhoods in the San Fernando Valley of Los Angeles. The chase started around 7 p.m. when the California Highway Patrol says the RV failed to yield. When it looks like the driver is at a dead end in a parking lot, she narrowly escapes, rams into a palm tree, which rips the front side of the camper wide open and shears off the windshield. She's just slamming into everything in her way, slamming into every pole, every tree, every vehicle in her way. As the driver careens around this corner, one of her dogs leaps from the jagged opening in the RV. Oh, no! The dog is running away. The dog is okay. Later, she's seen desperately trying to hold on to her other dog while whipping through through this upscale neighborhood. That's when she loses control, plows into this sedan. Oh no! Oh my goodness! She leaps from what's left of the vehicle, running to the front gate of a home, her dog running beside her, until the highway patrol officers catch up to her and tackle her to the ground. And you know what? Investigators are saying this is potentially a DUI case. That driver, a woman in her 40s, is now being held on suspicion of several felony charges, including hit and run and animal cruelty. George. Wow, what a crazy, crazy story. Okay, Adrian, thanks.